I did hear tell not very long ago of three of the ICI scientists and they were they were making some tests as they called it anyway on a tarn down in Wales with a river just before it ran into the sea they were taking eight ounce sticks of gel ignite and putting a detonator on the end of the fuse and stuffing these in and lighting the fuse and tossing these in the river now the idea being there was about six foot of clear water and the column of water thrown up may be about 15 foot with the gel ignite it might be 25 or 30 foot with the submarine blasting gelatin and it said their excuse was it gave them some idea of the different strengths of the different types of explosive it was a nice day there was three of them there I suppose they got bugger all of them. Said, come along chaps let's go and toss a few in the river <laughs> anyway they didn't notice the local sportsmen walking across these water meadows behind them shotgun over the arm black Labrador dog and the dog was getting excited because it heard the pops and bangs that they were making <laughs> and he hadn't retrieved any game and he must have been thinking Christ he must be awful shot see <laughs> until he approached behind him and he saw one of these clowns throw one in and there was a splash <laughs> and the dog thought they must have shot something at last a duck it's over what so it's in and it's out again <laughs> Now, when you get a black lab retrieving eight ounces of jelly, <laughs> and when they and the fuse is burning down, and when they deliver it, they deliver it to hand, <laughs> which is about there, approximately nine inches from your knackers, <laughs> which is a nasty place to receive eight ounces of jelly night with a bloody fuse burning down. <laughs> it would definitely do you a mischief. <laughs> And uh, nobody wanted to know. One's trying to hide behind one and the other behind the other. And in the end, they're trying to crawl up the back of each other's jacket. <laughs> to no effect. And then they took the obvious course. They took to flight. Showering stones at the poor animal. Shouting, go away. Or... <laughs> Or something like that, anyway. It sounded more like a Russian word to finish with, off. <laughs> and the dog didn't understand the language because it had been brought up at good class kennels. <laughs> and the outcome of it was it cost the ICI 50 quid for a new dog. <laughs> One of the tragedies you get in life. 